Okay, so I will turn on Arduino first. So Arduino look like this. So uh, before you, okay, so I will first, I will explain about how to check uh, whether your Arduino board is okay or not. So actually that one you should always check whenever you start it because um, almost every day, uh, okay, so this one is electric device. But actually the voltage it will use is like a 12 volt. But actual voltage this microcontroller chip uses 5 volt. So actually it does not do any harm to you. But your dirty hand do a lot of harm to your Arduino. Because uh, actually whether you realize or not, your, uh, I don't know, your fabrics have a lot of electricity on it. And when you touch this backside of pins, actually, you are actually giving a lot of electric shock to this one. So like kind of two things and actually so it, this one can be easily die and then actually your uh, your oily dirty hands actually kind of <laughs> give a lot of rust on this electric devices which is very sensitive so I don't worry about your health but you should worry about the health of Arduino <laughs> <laughs> and one last thing you have to care about is that one has got a lot of uh, something sharp pins so, so be careful about that this one does not scratch your skin your skin that's only one bad thing happen, but could happen. Okay, so before you connect it, I would check, go to tools, and go to, okay, so make sure that your board is Arduino Uno. For me, I have, I'm using to, I'm going to use Arduino Mega, so I will select Arduino Mega. But in your case, make sure, because there are a lot of uh, variations of these boards, so please match that the board selected in the software and the hardware. And then the, again, the hardware you're going to use Arduino Uno. Okay, next time you have to set up a connection between your computer and this Arduino. And then actually, before you connect your hardware to computer, there are probably some ports already acquired by the computer itself. Then now I will connect it. Then new ports will be uh, activated or connected. So now if I see that, you see the COM3 is actually pops up, which means that the COM3 will be used for this Arduino. So, yeah, now, now please check, connect your Arduino to a computer and check what kind of new COM port uh, is kind of like uh, pops up in your Arduino software. What application is this? Uh, that is called Arduino. It doesn't Okay, so this one is so far how to check Arduino, uh, how to connect.